Uh, John, uh, the uh, the Huron Shore, the Rotary Huron Shore Run Walk is uh, growing by leaps and bounds. We've got two new uh, events included. How important is that for this to grow? It's uh, such an important event to the community, uh, supporting our uh, foundation for our hospital. So I like to see some change within the event, and this is uh, adding these two new events involving children and adults on bikes, uh, along with the rollerbladers. I think it's a great uh, mix and it uh, adds to the health of our community and at the same time raises money for our community. So it's a, that's what is our mission, is to have a community event that people can have fun at. John, is there a goal for uh, this year? No, we haven't set a goal. We just sort of, uh, we will do that next year. Uh, we uh, want to see where these new events will take us. That's one of the big things that we're uh, looking forward to. If we have lots of people, anything is going to uh, be better than last year. We have adverse conditions with weather and we're hoping that uh, we can set a benchmark this year and then work for a goal the following year. Now, your attitude towards the event, if I may say that, uh, as far as the committee is concerned, has changed. Uh, what message do you have for community members that just want to come out? We, our, our mission, or our, our main focus, is that it's a community event to have fun. We want you to come out with your grandchildren, with your children, with your friends, with your family, just to come out and enjoy the day along Lake Huron. Have fun. We, uh, we would like to, to make it a big event that fills up this street with people from uh, curb to curb and that we have an, a fun day. And then the, the bonus to all this is that if you come out and you don't donate a few dollars to the foundation that we help our hospital. So give us the facts and figures then. What day, what time, when do the events start? The day is June the 2nd. We will start early in the morning, uh, 7 if you like to come out and bike. We will have a bike race. Uh, or a fun bike time, it doesn't have to be a race. Uh, ten, at about 9.30, we're going to bring your children, your grandchildren out. We're going to have a uh, little race from the flight pool back to the Walker House. Uh, 500 meters just for fun, ages 3 to 8, just to have a good time play in Soggy and Shores. Then we have a race at 10 o'clock with the uh, runners, and but at the same time we will have rollerbladers and walkers with their pledges to say that they can do the kilometers they say they can do. So we look for a fun day. Okay, finally, uh, as far as uh, pre-registration goes, um, and you have a new website where you can pre-register. Yes, we're trying something new this year, and we certainly would like to uh, have people pre-register so we have an idea how many people would like to come. The new website, www.rotaryrun.net, is a great website, easy to navigate. You can easily find the forms and it would help us out a lot and I think it would help you at the same time to uh, enjoy the day more. And also, Friday, uh, that Friday night, June the 1st, we have a pre-registration at the uh, Scout Rotary Hall in Southampton. Good.